You'd think this would be easy to find. There's just oh, too much interference. Got you. So, first option. We chat about all of this, realize there is no problem, and help each other get off this planet safely. You'll find I'm very easy to work with. My duty reports always say works well with others. Option two then. But don't say I didn't try the peaceful option first. Bonus chance here. Sword versus phaser. Oh, right, uh, shield beats phaser then. Option three. I'll admit, my combat training's a bit rusty, but there wasn't much at the academy for fighting a Roman soldier. I have your knife. Now, do you want to surrender? Almost got me there. Mm. Oh. Computer, freeze program. After all that, holodex. Can't live with them, can't live without them. Computer, run a diagnostic and fix the glitch the next time I run the program. Next time, that cheap shot won't work. Computer, arch. Radio? Yep, just getting our orbital flight plan absolutely perfect. I'm jealous. Of my piloting skills. <laughs> I know. I make it look so easy. No, of your mission. Your joyride. It's not a joyride, it's an important survey mission. Which could be done with horizon sensors. It, it could, uh -huh. but the shuttle sensors at close proximity will be 3% more efficient. And that's the line you used a couple in a row, was it? No, I used my professional expertise as a scientist explorer and pilot to plead the case for the best success of the mission. It's a joyride. <sighs> joyride. Mm -hmm. Wish me uh, luck. Don't scratch the paint. No promises, but who knows what could happen. Main shuttle bay. Shuttle sailor, request permission to launch. Permission granted. Right, an 
an hour on the clock. The quicker I get this done, the more time I can just fly through the canyons. What the? No EM wake, walk trail, debris, no trace at all. What, what just happened? That can't be a coincidence. Computer, scan the unknown vessel. Unknown configuration, power levels rising. Well, that can't be good. Evasive maneuvers. Maybe shoot first is just their way of saying hello? Computer, open a channel. This is Lieutenant Anna Keeley of the Federation Starship Horizon. I I'm not looking for any conflict. We thought this system uninhabited and we were simply just doing research on the planet. My ship has vanished. Can you assist? Warning, power buildup detected. This isn't how you make friends. Computer, arm phasers, target their weapons grid. Prepare to fire on my mark. Three, two... Th that wasn't me. Well, that's unexpected. Computer, hail that ship. Captain Hunter, what are you doing here? I was about to ask you the same thing, Lieutenant. I thought you were stationed at Chiron. Less than a minute ago we were. Now we're defending a Federation shuttle. That's all I've got. Where the hell are we? The Orion Sector. That's 200 light years away. Where's Horizon? It vanished. Then this alien ship showed up with you right behind. Coincidence? <laughs> Based on their weapons fire, I'd say no. It's good to see you, Captain. You too. Use Intrepid as cover. Here they come again! You know, when I ordered torpedoes, I kinda liked them to hit something. Hail Keely! I'm guessing Horizon vanished a little like our new friends. Exactly the same energy readings. So either they're behind us and ran, or were sent somewhere else. We can narrow down those options pretty quick, if I'm right. Have a look at your sensor logs and see what you detected on the Delta 14516 waveband. Do it. Based on these readings, I'd say that the energy used to freeze out of the system came from inside of their ship. That's not conclusive proof. Wait, phase out? The energy signature matches phase displacement technology. They've moved out of our dimensional plane. Their design matches nothing in my database. Run the ship yourself, see if you get anything. I'll be a son of a... We've got a match. Put it on screen. It's a Kabali ship. Kabali? Rings a bell. Who are they? Voyager encountered them in the Delta Quadrant. Delta Quadrant, of course. I remember now. Here I thought you came a long way, but were the Kabali advanced enough for phase displacement drives? Voyager never learned much about them as far as I can remember, so maybe? Well, they have it now. I'd say the technology is experimental, based on these energy fluctuations. Could they be testing on us? But why us? Why a quadrant away? Three Kobali ships have appeared. They're on an intercept course. I don't like those odds. Scan those ships for possible weaknesses. And Keeley, stay in our shield bubble. Captain Hunter, have you left Sharon Station recently? A survey mission or two. Gotta stretch the old space legs. Did you pass through an asteroid belt or comet trail? A comet, yes. What are you thinking? I'm making the short version. Those ships will be on us any minute. Dantix particles. This planet creates them in its atmosphere. When I flew too close, my hull picked them up. I'm detecting the same particles on your hull too. I can't find any Dantex particles in the atmosphere. But I do detect traces on our hulls. That doesn't make any sense. 
actually, I think it does. Maybe. Horizon. She didn't move out of phase. I did. We're in an alternate dimension and here this planet's particles don't exist. Let me try something. Set course 259, mark 41. What's she doing? Oh, I see what she's doing. Remodulating the deflector dish to a medium pulse. Hang on, Hunter Tequili. Do you want to explain to the idiot in charge what you're doing before you start acting without orders? It's the particle, sir. That was the catalyst. That's what their technology focused on and brought us into this dimension. But we can follow them out. There's a trace of the particles, but it's fluctuating. It's the tear we were pulled through, and... We can get back the same way. I think so. My entry point's already dissipated, but Intrepid's terror is still there. Based on the readings of the Kabali ships, I'm sending you a frequency to set your deflector to. Already on it. I'm sending my calculations, Lieutenant. Oh, right. I forgot to carry the one. That's perfect. I'll use my deflector to start the process, and then you use Intrepid's big gun. At the rate this thing's going, we don't have long. Hell, increase speed. Deflector on my mark. Full power. Now! Shields down to 43%. The tear? I think it's working. You think? Massive sensor interference, but my gut says it's working. working but not completely. Think Anna, think! What am I missing? Keely to Intrepid, I know how we can make it work. We need to use the remaining particles left on our hulls. It's the catalyst, the key. Shields at 27%. Divert power to aft shields. Whatever you're gonna do, do it fast. I've used a quantic vibration matrix to draw the remaining particles into a focused beam. <sighs> I've only got one shot at this. I've got to get close. Good luck, Captain. She's going in. Oh, damn it, Keely, it's not a race. Start vibration matrix and send out a new pulse. Already calibrated. Ready to fire. Helm, take us in. Fire particle beam. Where am I? You make it through in one piece, Lieutenant? Well, at first glance, I'm alive. I'll have to send you a full report once I know more, of course. I take it this is Sharon Station? Welcome to my home away from home. And a long way from yours. Horizon will be wondering what happened. We're being healed by the Newton. Put them on screen. Hunter, one second you're orbiting next to us and then you disappear? I know you were losing our checkers game, but this was a bit too far. Are you alright? What happened? Hey, I was just being a good host and letting you win. First time in the sector and all that. But yeah, we're fine. And I brought a friend back with me. Ca uh, Captain Shepard, it's... it's good to see you. You too! Uh, sorry, have we met before? Um... <laughs> not exactly. Lieutenant Anakili, USS Horizon. Horizon. Is Monroe around here somewhere, or didn't he want to come too, since he knows he owes me another another bottle of Romulan whiskey? No, it's it's just me. 
We were kidnapped by an alien race from the Delta Quadrant in some kind of experimental, transdimensional propulsion experiment. It'll all be in my report. Right. Yes. That sounds like an interesting read for sure. <laughs> okay, then. Can we assist either of you in any way? You look a little banged up, Intrepid. Nothing we can't fix. But perhaps you can help Lieutenant Keeley. Do you tell. She's a tad off course. And once a Newton gets underway, I think you're heading in the same direction. We were exploring the Orion sector, and now I'm here, 200 light years away. If you're going that way, any chance for a lift? You're a very long way off course. Yes, I'm sure we can help. And if it means Monroe owes me one more, then hey, sounds like a plan. Thank you, Captain. And Captain Hunter, we make a good team. That we do. You know, it'll be a while until we can get a message to Monroe on the horizon. Why don't you dock at the station and we can all grab a coffee? I could certainly use one. I can do that. I'll beam over and I can tell you an embarrassing story about my old friend Monroe. <laughs> I know just the one. Coffee plan. Love it. I'll dock now. Captain? Captain? Well, today didn't go as planned, but that was actually kind of remarkable. Delta Quadrant, that's so cool.